Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add a website link to your Facebook business page, whether you have a classic or a new Facebook page. This is just going to be a quick video tutorial. So if you want to get more details about this process, then check out our more detailed blog post on rihex.com, where we also share some additional information. You can also find hundreds of tutorials there on social media and Facebook page marketing for absolutely free. One more thing before the tutorial, if you want to get more Facebook page followers, more organic reach, without running Facebook ads, then check out our Facebook page growth checklist that you can download from our website, ryhex.com, since we are giving it away for free. Links to the 50 point checklist in the description below. All right, so the process of adding a website is a little bit different, whether we have a new or a classic Facebook page. First, let's have it done with a classic Facebook page. So all you have to do is open up the Facebook page and there are multiple ways how you can add links to the website. The first one is to add it as a call to action button. In this case, all you have to do is open up the Facebook page and click on add a button here. If you have already added some kind of CTA button, it will say something like edit and the name of the button. So click on this. And if you want to just add a single link, then select learn more, and then you can add the name of the website. But for instance, if you want to link to the contact us page of your website, then you can also select contact us, sign up works as well. So there are several options that allow you to link to your website. Right, the second option is to scroll down the page and to this about section. And here you're gonna be able to also add a website link here on, by clicking on the enter website button here, add the name of the website and just exit out and it, it will be added to your Facebook page. All right, so let's how it's done with a new Facebook page. As I mentioned, the process of adding website link to a new Facebook page is a little bit different. First, you have to open the Facebook page and then click on the switch now button so you can manage the Facebook page as a Facebook page admin. Then click on edit page here. And I have already added the website, but if you haven't added the website link yet, then click on edit here. Then go to the website section, click on the pencil icon, then click on the pencil icon here and add the name of the website. As you can see, you can add multiple website links here. So if you have multiple e-commerce websites or anything like that, you can add multiple websites there. All right, so if you want to add a call to action button to your websites, which would be placed somewhere around here, then you would have to click on these three dots here and select add action button and click on try it and here select learn more and click next and here you can add the name of the website and then click on the save button here and now if we go back to view it as a personal profile now we can see that there is a learn more button and if people click on this they will be taken to our website we have just added before we would wrap up just make sure to check out our free Facebook page growth checklist so you can get the 50 checkpoints we use every time to 10x the number of followers of any Facebook page we are planning to charge money for this checklist in the future, so get it now for free until you can. You can get the checklist by clicking in the description below or search on Google for ROIHacks.com and uh, add the query Facebook page growth checklist spreadsheet. Also, if you want to learn more about setting up, managing, growing a Facebook page, make sure to check out our Facebook page tutorial YouTube playlist that you can see on the screen here. See you next time.